I'm a councillor for Harrington, but obviously I live on Salterbeck. And I've spoke to people on Salterbeck and Harrington, and they're just finding it so, so difficult. I'm finding it difficult. I find myself having to cut back on a lot of stuff. I cut back on my shopping because I either buy lots of shopping and stay cold and sit in the dark with no TV, or I buy less shopping so I can afford to keep the electric on. There's quite a little community and we all start chewing the fat and talking about the price of energy and not one person, and it's a very diverse group, hasn't been affected. We're all worried about it. We all stressed over it last year. Um, we've all got different health issues or financial concerns, but across the board, we can't keep coping with these energy prices, something has got to change, something's got to give. I think one of the things that's been really bad in the community uh, with regards to the energy is the fact that they're breaking into people's houses to put prepayment meters in, which then obviously cost more because the tariffs on the prepayment meters are higher than the deals that you can get out there. When I was young, they privatised the, the energy companies so that people would have a choice of a low, the lowest price to pay. Well, that's slightly changed now. They don't have a choice. Something needs to be done. Something actually needs to be done because people just can't afford to keep going on like this. There needs to be more support. Last year was just beyond me. And it feels like this year is going to be the same and there's going to be no government help, apparently. Um, so the stress of that's unbelievable. More and more people in this local area are struggling, especially working people. They're not uh, well off working class people they're, they're just about managing people and a lot of them are struggling and a, and a few hundred more pounds on a energy bill to some of these people in these areas it is going to devastate them and it's going to devastate communities and it's going to put people into debt debt that they can't get out of